I'm reading Edgar Casey's Little Black Book. It was fun going for a walk today in the snow, but it was so cold. I had to come in. Um, later I went for another walk in the sun, uh, but I didn't take my camera with me because it got all fogged up from the first walk. So Now I'm making homemade bread and I'm reading a book. actually reading about fasting and I'm fasting today. I'm trying to fast for 20 hours so I can eat at 6 o'clock. <laughs> Fasting is really good for the body. It gets rid of old cells that the body doesn't need, toxins, it can eat away cancers, things like that. I've been fasting off and on for the last few years and it's worked really well for me. It also helps to lose weight and right now I need to lose some weight. <laughs> so I'm going to try for a 20 hour fast today. The longest I've ever fasted was just under two days, so it was actually like just under 48 hours. I think it was like 45 hours, which I was really proud of myself to do that. I can't imagine how people can manage for five days or seven days or even ten days. That's got to be difficult. Um, I would like to get to a point to where I can do another two-day fast and try to make it to a full 48 hours. <laughs>
soon we'll have some homemade potato soup, cheesy homemade potato soup, and homemade bread. I'm going to put the recipes in the description below. Thanks for coming. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and leave me a comment. I'm ending my fast at 18.5 hours rather than 20 because I just made too much good food. Uh, if you guys want the recipe to this really fabulous cheesy potato soup or my homemade bread with cheese and onions, you can find it in the description below. My face is all red now from being out in the snow all day. It was cold out there, guys. My eyelashes literally froze and they stuck together. So this is the bread, homemade bread. It's really delicious. You actually cook it for about uh, 11 to 12 minutes, sometimes a little bit longer, just depending. And this is the soup. Mm. <laughs> mm. 
I make the best soup and the best bread, you guys. Check the description below for the recipes. Oh yeah. Thanks for coming. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and leave me a comment.